Today I am playing Pokemon Emerald, but Pokemon Challenges, self-proclaimed best Nuzlocker in the world, is going to control all of the other trainers. He will be able to make any decision he likes, he will be able to use any Pokemon they have, any items they have, at his discretion. Should we say hello to Pokemon Challenges? What, uh, just so, so my chat knows who you are, if they're not aware, what, uh, what kind yeah. of stuff do you do? My name is Pokemon Challenges, so, um, I, I naturally play a lot of Pokemon Challenges. I've never done a hardcore Nuzlocke before. The rule you guys need to care about is if my Pokemon faints, they're dead. I'll explain more rules as they come up. Okay. I've been thinking a lot about this run. It's really interesting um, because so much of Nuzlocking is AI control mm -hmm. and AI prediction and knowing how the AI works. The strategy is completely different because, yeah, like you would just expect the AI to do something. And in this one, I can't yeah. expect anything. You can go crazy with it. Which is the best for a Nuzlocke? It's probably not this one or this one, right? Because the... Someone didn't watch my tier list video. Uh, well, here's the thing. It's completely different when it's against another person. True. You know what? This is not going to be a strategic decision. But I'm picking this one. Oh, I'm gonna be able to tell from the cry. You will. Yeah, that's Mudkip, okay. <laughs> yep, I may have picked Mudkip. That's good the, choice, good That's choice. the only advantage you get is you can hear what's going on. Yeah. I was thinking, okay, what what is the best Pokemon to pick? It's, it's for sure Mudkip. It is Mudkip? Um, yeah. Swampert has like, it only has a grass weakness and there's like two grass trainers in the entire game. Plus like the rival fights. That's okay, like, I'll just need to like, avoid them. I'm probably not gonna Google anything, by the way. Although that's yeah, like yeah, the optimal fine. play. I think it'll be more interesting if I go into a lot of battles. For sure. Not yeah. knowing what to expect. What's a combination of Adrian and at sign? What do you guys think? Gotta name it after them. Ad sign? Ad I sign is good. I don't know. Let's stick with this. So there's a level cap. I can't get past a certain level. What is that level yes. cap for gym one? Do you know? I Offhand? believe it's 15. 15? Yeah. Okay, that's actually not too bad. Do you want to tell Chad about the rare candies? Yeah, so I have unlimited rare candies and max repels, but there is a level cap. So you guys won't see any grinding yep. today. I totally yep. forgot about that. Thank you for reminding me. I'm going to go grab that. I'm so glad I got everyone on the rare candy train for Nuzlocke and specifically. Yeah, specifically for Nuzlocke's, I'll do it, but anything else? It's so much nicer. Mm -hmm. By the way, 99 rare candies will definitely not be enough. <laughs> no, you don't think that'll be enough? Absolutely not. A level 100 Mudkip can't be a level 5 Rico? Well, I guess for, the, for, for this fight, <laughs> but like eventually you're, you'll run out. Oh yeah, right? yeah, I'll, I'll grab more when I need them. Alright, you ready? Ready right, for I'm your first battle? I'm excited to see what level you level to for this. Yeah, I, I think this this will work. I think, I think I'm think i I'm set here. Okay, I'm excited. Small Ant wants to battle. Yeah, I do want to battle. I could technically lose this if I miss my tackles. Oh god. Am I gonna lose on the first battle? You got a good level advantage. Just, I do. I figured two levels would be enough. This could do like 50, right? Is, oh. Yeah, you'll be fine. I, I am faster, yeah. and tackle can miss. That's like what I think I, I have as an advantage here. Oh, yeah, never okay, mind. Yeah, you're I, fine. I, I'm fine. fine. I got this. Fine. Okay. <laughs> After a leer. Unless I miss like two 5% in a row. Three 5%? I don't know. Yeah. There's no way I lose this. There's just no way. With leer, it did three damage. Yeah, I got a good uh, IV mud kit. Oh yeah, what nature are you? I'm not gonna tell you that. Uh, true, yeah, yeah, yeah that's I'm not, good for my calculator. I'm not giving you that information. <laughs> I assume this gives me literally the Pokemon of the opponents with their IVs and nature yeah, that they have. In exactly. The ROM, right? You also okay. have the items they have. Oh, I wonder what my nature is, chat. Let's check. Oh, let's go. Oh my god. What does that do? I'm just trying to intimidate him. I won't say what it is, but it's not a bad one. All right. Yep. It's okay, chat. I, it's like all right. I guess I probably encounter here, huh? Really hope that there's something good here. I wanted a Wingull for the, the gym the leader. Gina? Could have been. You won't want Wingull. I mean, Wingull, the water type, is good for the Geo dudes. But this has Intimidate. Oh my goodness. Wait a minute. Yeah. I have a question. Yeah, what's up? So I can only catch the first Pokemon in each route, right? Yes. What is the rule if I happen to run into a shiny Pokemon? Like, <laughs> kill it or. So my, a lot of Nuzlocke do shiny claws, where if you find a shiny, <laughs> you can just catch it and use it. Yeah. And that's fun. <laughs> I have a version of shiny claws. If I run into a shiny and I already have that Pokemon, I may catch the shiny and replace the Pokemon on my team with the shiny. Okay. All right. I'll, I'll name it this chat. Because, yeah, I, I did just catch a shiny. Have you gotten Pokerus in any of your runs before? I have. I think in two different runs I got Pokerus. I noticed the yeah. text once was longer. I was like, what the heck was that? It's really rare. Yeah, um, like one in 20,000. I've only gotten it like twice in any of my runs. Do I do the encounter before or after? I sh I'm going to do the encounter after. Just because. Just for fun. Here we go. I can't go past level 15 in chat, which is why I'm being so careful with the levels. He doesn't know that he could easily level all of his Pokemon with candies to 13 or maybe even 14 right now. and be completely fine. Oh, we're fighting. We are fighting, you and I, right now. You got a Poochiana, and I got a Shiny. Oh, you do it? Wait, what the fuck? That's so crazy. Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right, level eight versus level five. What's he gonna okay. do? 
I'm gonna need you to miss some tackles here. <laughs> miss? Nope, that's not more than <laughs> some tackles. It's okay. He low rolls here. Mm -hmm. Oh my Ooh, god! I did does. low roll. No, any crits here? Okay, no crit, no crit. Hey. That feels so good for Gym 1. That is huge for Gym 1. Is it IX or YX, chat? There we go. I have a, a familiar face for you. I'm so excited. It's too easy to use the candies. You never need to challenge the trainers. Would you rather I just fight wild Pokemon for an hour? <laughs> so that's what the people want to see. That's obviously. what they want to see. Yep. You know what? I'm pretty sure. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Not that I can really use that. I can't. Why? I know where all of the hidden items are, but none of them are useful. I didn't realize that until now. Speedrunners are really good at knowing where like all the items are, so it's, it's oh, really interesting. I guess it's battle time. Ooh. Okay. Yep. Oh god! I accidentally walked into this trainer. I'm scared. I <laughs> 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 nice. Good luck. All right. It's okay. We got. We got. We got strategy. We got strategy. <laughs> what, do I, what, what do I go for, chat? I am a higher level than you. I'm not giving you the satisfaction. <laughs> No! You forfeited! <laughs> the only way to win is to not play. <laughs> oh, right. I forgot about this encounter, too. All right. Okay, I have a question, because whenever... Like, when we were fighting the Wurmple earlier in Route 1, people were saying Dustox Prage. Why? Yes. Is it because it, like, learns confusion or something for Gym 2? Dustox or... is really good for Gym 2, yeah. I, I think people are overrating it a little bit, but it's 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 really decent for Gym 2. My fingers are crossed. Can you tell from the silhouette which one's gonna be? Yes, it's the right one. This is the one we wanted. Yeah, you should be scared. I'm quaking in my boots. <laughs> Alright, I just need to get one more encounter. He's not doing encounter routing chat, Lamau. No, I can't get that. Hmm. That is so good for this freaking gym! Did you fucking mute so I wouldn't hear the cry? What do you mean? <laughs> uh, I do have two Pokemon, so I will get into a double battle. I just realized. I think this is fine, chat, right? The thing is, the mindset I need to get into, especially for these double battles, I don't need to win the fights. I need to kill something. Yeah. yeah. Guess what? You, you're actually two people right now, fun fact. Oh, sick. I love it when that happens. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're only level six. Okay, never mind. Do I growl here, chat? I wonder what the play is. I, I, I think I just need to try to somehow get a kill with Bide. And the idea of growl would be like, okay, that means he can't kill the CDOT in like one hit and maybe Bide will go through. I think growl is the play. So much to think about here. These Pokemon fucking suck. I'm you, not gonna lie, bro. Yeah, I mean, they're level six. You didn't use Bide. Wow. I know CDOT is like, it always uses Bide every single time I get into the battle. It's just Bide, Bide, Bide. It's actually like killed one of my Pokemon before. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. It doesn't have priority in Gen 3. Yeah. Mm, okay. Yeah, I think this, is, this if you, is... I think if you play it right, you should always win. Yeah, always. Come on. Finish. Okay, good. All right, I need to get one item before we hit the gym chat. If you've watched a lot of Jan's content, it will all make sense. Yep. He knows what I'm getting. Damn it. I do. I, I can't tell if that's the trainer school music game. Yeah? Okay. So quick claw. Now, which Pokemon am I giving the quick claw to? I guess I'll find out. I could catch another one, so I bring six in. But like... I think from what I've seen from your team, you're pretty well equipped for this. Yeah, I think I am I will probably do all right in this gym. Okay, I'm just got a few more levels. I'm just really... I'm making sure that I don't... Uh, no, I get it. You're nervous. It's okay. I, yeah, it's, okay. it's... Well, you're real good. Onyx says the Quick Claw. We're going to give Orin Berries to everyone else. Who do I give Bullet Seed to, chat? Do I give it to Onyx or Brogate? I'm not sure. Yeah, I think we're going to go with this one. Good. All right, I think we're ready for this gym. I think I'll be okay. I think I will switch turn one. I'll do some calcs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got this. No problems. Oh, fuck berries. Oh, no. I forgot. That. Dude, that's my... I do that so often. Uh, I forgot. Like, I will prepare for five hours. For like, okay, I need this. I need this. I need this. I press A on the gym leader and immediately remember something I should have done. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. All right. All right. Best play here is definitely this. Okay, he withdraws. Interesting. Switching out, I see. Well, why is that? Um, so fun fact, you d you've never heard about this before, but her second Geodude, I just realized, is actually slower than her first Geodude. Okay, okay. And it, interesting. Yeah, we'll yeah, see if that so matters. Fun. Wait, how, yeah. how much? Is it like a one point difference? It's a two point difference. One is nine speed, the other is 11. That's actually I think bigger than I thought it would be. Huh. Depending on your low tad speed, this is going to matter for speed drops. Okay. All right, we're going to get the five hits uh, and two crits during those five hits. Actually, no, I think if I crit once, it's only five. You know what? You'll see. Yep. Check this damage. This is going to be... Checking. Yeah, here's the one hit. Here's the two hit. Here's the three hit. 
Unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Miss. <sighs> good start. Good start. Yeah, re really good. It, that actually just does not matter because uh, I have a quick claw. True. I'm also dead to four hit now, I believe. You are. I'm not dead to three hit, though. The problem is the citrus berry procs at the end of the turn. It will not proc between bullet seed hits. Mm -hmm. So you might just completely bypass it here. That's Emerald Kaizo strats. True. Where you do a little bit of damage first, and then you do more damage later to bypass the berry. Yeah, I'm totally, right. I was planning on doing that for sure. Yeah, yeah. No, I know, I know. I'm going to bullet seed and maybe hope he... Hmm. I think we win if we spam Absorb still. As long as he doesn't use block. I think Absorb is the best play. Because if he used a potion, then Bullet Seed is just not enough. We'll Absorb and then Bullet Seed, I think. That's gonna proc his Orin. No, we use Rock Tomb. I think Potion was his best play. Okay. Quick Claw did not proc. No. It's good it damage. The Quick Claw did not proc. No. You got, also got a high roll. Fun fact. Ooh, interesting <laughs> choice. Mm hmm. Very interesting. So this procs my berry. It totally does. He needed a bull seed there. Like, he did that basically did nothing. It's appeal him a little bit. I'm not sure if he's at less or more health now. Okay, we're risking it. I'm risking everything. Let's hope he doesn't potion. Yeah! Okay, this is fine. As long as it doesn't crit. As long as you don't crit here, this is. Whew. Show me the four hit. <laughs> four. Four, please. Please give me four. One. Two. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get the four hit. Get the four hit. Get the four hit. Get, get the four, four, four. Uh, no! Okay. I got another two hit. This is ridiculous. Here's the question, chat. I potion, right? He knows I switch here. If he switches, potion is really good. He's gonna use block probably to try and trap one of my Pokemon in. We we get out sped now. I don't think I potion. Cause here's the thing. If he stays in and hopes for the rock tomb, 80% of the time I just kill Lotad. Does he potion here? I just realized. If I potion, a lot of the times I just go back down to 10 HP and achieve nothing. And if he switches and I rock to him, I can still potion the next turn. I think potion is just bad here. I think I have to attack. If he potions here, I should absorb. I could get the quick claw pop. Good luck. I'm just, I'm one in five for the quick claw pop. If That's I get it. the quick claw pop, I would just beat it. If you use a potion, torrent. Put me in a torrent, you coward. Do it. Yes! Woo! Insane. Oh. Well, I believe I have no plays. This just outspeeds both Nose Pass and Geodude. I'm pretty sure we just win now. Water gun two shots. I don't think we lose now. I mean, I got a potion. Okay, so max efficiency is to not potion this turn and rather rock to him. So let's do that. Because I only heal 19 here if I potion instead of 20. I don't think Water Gun is going to KO, so we go for the Mud Slap to try and reduce his accuracy to prevent this next Rock Tomb from hitting. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Okay. This, is st this is still fine. This is still fine. Does he potion here? He did 14. Oh my god, I'm in crit range. I think we just Water Gun now. We just Water Gun. He's 100% going Water Gun here, right? He has to. Okay, that's your last potion. Correct. Come on. Come on. Crit. Crit. No. Miss. Miss. No. Nice. Okay, thank god you didn't crit. Uh, I'm not even Torrent, am I? Oh no. He didn't even bring me to Torrent range. It yeah, I think the berry saves you. <laughs> not if I get crit. If I get crit, we're dead. Only thing I can do is hope for a crit. Please All don't right. crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Please no crit. Please do not crit. No, oh, it hit. Crit, crit, no, no, crit, no, no, crit, no, 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 don't, crit, don't do crit. it. Woo! Oh, fuck. Okay. okay. Nice, <laughs> God, that was terrifying. He could still kill something if he gets a crit. How much HP do you have left? Uh, less than break a, out the ruler? Uh, less, less than a third. You could break out the ruler if you really want to, though. All right, I don't think it matters. Uh, what do I do here? I think he has to switch. Right? But I think you can just go Lombre. This one? Yeah. I think this is the right play. Oh. And because you told me your Geodude's exact speed stat, I know I outspeed. True. I shouldn't have done that. Thank you. Well played. Thank you! That was terrifying. Two bullet seeds? Two? Man. Although that- Oh! That's literally one HP. Doesn't matter, but- If you crit here- Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Sturdy? What? Not in my Gen 3. That's, that's literally sturdy, yeah. I got one. I got a, I got a badge. Sick. Yes. That was closer than I thought it would be. 
All right, time to get a bunch of X items. You allow those, right? No um, healing items in battle, but X items are fine? Yeah, I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Uh, I guess this is my encounter. Huh, I know that cry. I feel like that's not the best encounter to get in this area, I'll be honest. Probably not. Here we go, sub to alpha, because he's not sub to alpha red. How do you do the, you pause the game, you open the Pokemon menu, and then do you just walk? Screw it, no fear. Nice. <sighs> it's okay, it's just youngster Johnson. Look at this shroomish. Yeah, look at this shroomish. This could be really annoying. Oh, he's only level eight, what am I doing? That'll okay, all right. Does that lock me into uproar? <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> It's like one of the worst moves in Nuzlocke's. <laughs> it's fine. As long as he doesn't have like Leech Seed or something, it'll be okay. You're level eight. I'm not gonna lose a Pokemon to a level eight Shroomish. Yeah, okay. So Good. it's a slight level diff. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna switch perspectives. Oh my God, I almost got into a second battle. Bring it on, Grunt. I super have to reprogram my brain because it's never about winning the battle, it's about winning the war, right? Just yeah, like getting killing like, one Pokemon. Snipes. Even if it's just like going for like low chance stuff that like can maybe kill something. I don't think that's gonna be the case, I'll be honest. Oh. Oh, you mean like that? I just have to play for my for the conditions that can maybe get me something. Uh-huh. You know, I won't switch. I, I, I won't. Mm, okay. Uh, that's, I've, I'm not committed to that yet. You're really gonna switch on the one level 11 Puccino? You're that I, scared? I mean, if I can't hit you, you know, it's... I'm just not- no, I'm not gonna switch, it's fine. It's just a level 11 Pucciata, it's like you said. It's... Yeah! yeah. You, <laughs> you were never worried there, ever. I was never concerned. Fight the rival for dominance? True, there's do a I rival fight here. I, I don't know what the- if I knew what the rival had, I would do it. Do, 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 do. Ah, wait, what? Uh-oh. Um, no, I do not want to have a battle. Unlucky. Okay. I thought you might smash through it. What encounters do I get in the cave? I'm pretty sure different floors have different encounters. And I, I know you know this. Yep. I'm pretty sure the bottom floor has the highest chance for Sableye. I could be wrong, but logically that makes sense. So I'm going to go to the bottom floor. It's not great, but it's not great. It's one of my favorite Pokemon, but for the Nuzlocke, it's really not good. What do you think he got, Chad? There's a Sableye. That would be upsetting. Ooh, I have an idea. We're gonna get soft sand. I said these two. I think it might be these two. Did you go to the beach? No. I'm trying to figure out what the sounds where you are right now. This is such a fun mini game. <laughs> <laughs> now what did I just get? You get one guess. If you guess it, I'll tell you that it, if you're right or not. Silk scarf? Nope. Can Sable Eye learn cut? Shut the fuck up. This is a genuine question. Yes, it can. Sweet. Oh, that was error on your teaching. Fuck! <laughs> Damn it! Why does it cry? Why? It is a Sableye. I mean, if you had a Sableye, it would just be over for me. Yeah, well, can you just not hit me if I have a Sableye? Yep. Are we running into, into gym trainers? I hope not. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. That would be a terrible thing. All right, um... Uh... uh is it right or left? Ah! All right, are you ready? I'm so fucking ready. I'm nervous. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. It's time, Brawly! Oh, you're right. I should have given it that item. Ah. Oh. Shut the fuck up. You're so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I should have given Whisper the Quick Claw. Okay, what's the lead? Here what's we the go. Lead? Pilot. So I think we just need to max damage Seismic Toss this because this is the most damage we can possibly do to this Dust Dustox. The only way we can force it out is if we like actually start doing damage to it. I don't know. Let's just do this. This is probably the optimal play. We'll see. I think the only time Meditite is going to be useful, like I can set up screens with it, but it's really mid, right? I have no idea what this Machop knows. I'm hoping only fighting moves. Fingers crossed it's only fighting moves. Like if something is low HP after a, after a battle and I can force a switch, he maybe doesn't know that it only has Focus Punch and then we go for the Focus Punch and hit something. I, th I think we just go for the Seismic Toss here. Okay. What did he use? Like probably not bulk up. What would he use then? I don't know. That doesn't one damage. shot. Oh. Oh, you have... Ah, that's bad. So we're dead to the next confusion. We could switch to Meditite now. What is the best play for you to do here, huh? If we switch to Meditite now, we potion Machop once, we throw out the light screen, and we go from there. I think I just need to, just confusion, right? Unless he like, tries to pee pee stall? Oh, I never considered that. 
If I light screen first, I take less damage. If I potion first, I get more light screen turns. I'm gonna potion first. I'm gonna giga chad. I'm giga chatting right now. If he uses confusion, this is the right play. There's no way he predicts. Only an idiot would do that. And if it uses confusion, I think we have to switch into Onyx. I think Onyx is the best play. I've made my selection. Okay. So this Lotad has fake out, I think. I think I want a light screen, but he's gonna fake out. I'm gonna take free damage. So he's probably most likely to fake out and then bullet seed. I'll try to get up a light screen, I guess. Maybe I can bait a switch after the light screen and I'll throw out a random focus punch. All right, let's do this. Okay, what's he gonna do? What is it? Nice. Doesn't matter. Didn't switch. Ooh, that's some juicy damage. Hmm, now what? <laughs> so the problem is... I didn't consider the fact that I might just die. He can kill me here if he rolls high. Four hits is enough. He needs four hits to kill Meditate. We do have Bullet Seed. We also have Astonish. Astonish will do the same amount of damage, but it could flinch. Bullet Seed is his best move here. If he goes for anything else, he's inting. With my special stat being so much higher, I think we go Bullet Seed. Okay, I chose my move. Oh, never mind. Please. Yeah, you please, need four. Please, 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 please. Come on, come on. Yes. Yes, come on. Yes! Well played. I got the four. <sighs> it's huge. That is pretty big. What were you trying to use there? Uh, light screen. Oh, that would have been massive. Yeah, it was a bit greedy. I knew you were faking out the turn one, so I kind of wanted to switch to Makuhita, but I figured I could probably get a light screen up. Mm, preventing the screens is massive. Makuhita uses bulk up here 100% of the time, right? The thing is, I don't really want to bulk up. Our thrust does a lot of damage, but it's it's probably gonna three shot, and like bullet seed is also probably gonna three shot. I guess I have a berry and still have a citrus. Uh, actually, if he doesn't bulk up, then shiny just dies. That would be stupid. My throw is a guaranteed three KO, and if we put reversal in there too, I'm just gonna force him to switch eventually. Wait, no, he has a uh, vital throw. He's always gonna crit, so uh, intimidate doesn't matter. We just switch it to pilot, right? If I bulk up once, vital throw probably is a yeah. two at KO. I think I'll bulk. <laughs> Ones. All right, this is tough. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping you didn't do something. That was the something I hoped you didn't do. Very cool. It might not matter. If we get the confusion, that would be huge. I have no outs here. He completely out damages me. Should be a four at KO after Barry. We quad resist because we're poison bug. So I get three hits and a vital throw. That's like 30% damage. Ah, uh, you know what? There's also reversal. Yeah, we just gotta attack. Circle throw always crit. Vital throw. To oh, vital throw never misses. Oh, I misremembered. Oh, I should have. That would have been so funny. What is that damage? That was a low roll. No crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Please. Oh, wait, what? Wait, why is that a two at KO? I mean, I don't have four X resist, but he's a plus one. My calc has this at doing like 35 to 40. Why was that a straight up two at KO? Did six damage, 24, 18. Yeah, actually, you know, that lines up. I guess my stats aren't that good and his are pretty good. He should probably arm thrust. He has to just arm thrust now, right? And hope for a crits. Reversal here. I need to be at 12 HP or below for reversal to be more than vital throw. Arm thrust is his best play because he has more chances to crit. Arm thrust high roll. I don't think it matters. I die in two hits. Um, first high roll isn't even enough damage. But yeah, confusion always kills in two, so I think I think we're fine here. I don't think he has any way to win. I still have seismic toss on the chop. Yeah, I can get a crit here, maybe. Okay. Let's see what he does. Ooh, it was a high roll. Uh oh. This might be really good for us. We can reversal now. This is huge. Crit does 12, but I have the Orenberry. Yes, that's so good. Okay. There's no way he wouldn't just attack again, right? I think we win this. Yeah, we just we just straight win this now. There's like no way. I think we got a reversal. Good luck. Yeah, this is this is tough. Good luck. Wait, what is that? <sighs> oh, fuck. Yeah, good Dude. luck. Dude. Thank you. <laughs> I had a reversal. Reversal? Yeah. I, I didn't even on, like one there. Oh, if I got a low roll there. <sighs> oh, that was actually really clutch. That would have been crazy it wouldn't have killed you but it, it puts you into seismic toss range yeah exactly like that would have killed potentially killed a pokemon i mean you have a potion left too yeah exactly now now i feel what it's like on the other side of the nuzlocke when the nuzlocker gets lucky man <laughs> it sucks <laughs> gg there's no way out yeah reversal would have put you into seismic toss range Sick. I've made it further than I expected. If I win this, do I get to call myself the best Nuzlocke in the world, or how's that work? If you win the whole run, yeah. maybe. Well, uh, could we like be like tied? I have to. Um, you talk to the council. Yeah, I have to talk to the Nuzlocke validation council first. Ah, uh, okay, okay. I have an idea. I have to do this in speed up because I don't want them knowing that I'm doing this. I want to surprise them. Oh shit! I was unmuted. I'm still gonna surprise them. What? 
Why is there a goldie in there? Tanner, are you fishing somewhere? No. You did just catch something. I did just catch literally something. the only route that you could go to to catch something would be to fish something. So is it a goldine? <laughs> could be. Do I fish here? Like, actually, I'll just fish here. Screw it. Doing more fishing. I'm assuming you're getting a magic carp, and I think you can also get a tentacle somewhere else, so you can make sure to pick those up, Tanner. Yeah, I'm sure a magic carp is going to be great for the gym. Hey, what's your least favorite Pokemon? The middle evolution of Gothitelle. I forgot what it's called. Gotharina? I need something for the starter, because it's a uh, grow vial. Yeah, I don't know. I guess one counter something. That could actually deal with the starter. That's also going to be good for the, the other gym, too. Don't mind me just catching my encounter. I've caught the encounter. Can you name this Gon? G-O-N. Gon. It doesn't learn any good moves, does it? It'll evolve at level 20, though, which is cool. I think this will go well. I'm going to be honest. Okay, there is this double battle. And you just have a little baby, I think. Wow, okay. that's, that's a great yeah. that's a great matchup. You know what? <sighs> I'm going to choose to not give you these speedy bees. Really? You're forfeiting? Yep. <laughs> Oh no, fair enough. Strategic forfeit. <laughs> he just forfeits every battle until the end. Yeah, yeah, why don't you just forfeit the rival battle? Just don't give me any True. EVs. I can't remember what you open with. The speedrun just play as a girl because they open with... Is it because they open with Slugma or because they don't want Slugma? I, they don't want Slugma because of the burn. I think we'll open with that. Oh, here we go. It's time. It's a Slugma! Damn it! It was... I thought it was a Wingle. Oh, wow. Ugh. <sighs> Oh, you named it Goth just for me. <laughs> okay. I, I, mean, I thought it was going to be a freaking Wingle, bro. Chat, did we put this to sleep? I think so, right? There's no way you can one-shot me. I think Yawn is really high value here. Does this sweep me is the question, right? Not if I perma-sleep it. Let's try Yawning. I'm pretty sure it has Rock Throw. So I need to just switch. I'm just going to intimidate it again because it's going to send out the Rock Throw. Interesting. Yeah, well, I, you you know Rock Throw, right? Um, do I? I'm pretty sure it knows Rock Throw. Oh. You do have the double Intimidate. That's extremely annoying. Yes. Okay, chat. One hard read. I can hear his audio. He's switching. <laughs> I just switch back to Intimidate him again to get rid of the yawn. One hard read on the switch, and we yawn again. I mean, like, if he stays in, it's not even that bad if I yawn. It's not like I can do a lot of damage to him, right? It's 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 great every time. Okay. Let's see what you used here. Hmm. Interesting. I can do this all day. I, I can't. I have PP. I know. <laughs> Shoes. All right, we're going to read the Mighty Anna switch here, and we're going to go to Grovile, I think. Or we could Smog. Let's Smog. Okay. Smog. Blech. Don't poison me. Yes. Unlucky. What a fucking shit move. <laughs> All right, I'm switching into my starter now, so I can just hit him with a mud shot and kill him. I guess I could just yawn again. He's probably biting now. We have the soft sand. We just need to hope he doesn't yawn. He uses smog again. Ed sign is in. Ah, oh, damn it. I was about to say, I hope you don't use yawn. Mind games. Yeah, the mind games. Is that what it feels like when I pee pee saw my fucking opponents in my Nuzlocke, man? Yeah, I'm just gonna go for it. It's fine. Okay, yeah, I, I, was, I was just done with that. Yeah, Unfortunately, it's set mode, so I fall asleep here. Yep, okay. Well, very cool. And I'm asleep. I mean, I have to switch anyways. I have to switch here, or else he's gonna kill me. He's probably switching, right? Let's pursue. The thing is, he's never bringing Marsh Tomp back out again. Any damage that we get on Marsh Tomp does not matter at all. Pursuit is, like, actually bad. What would he switch to? I don't know what he has is the problem. He should just attack me, should he not? Like, he, it's just free damage, because he knows I am switching. Reading my Diana with Fury Cut would be good. I, th I think Fury Cut is the highest EV choice. Which problem is I don't know what you use? have on your team. Gone. Okay. Oh. Interesting. Not a lot of damage, and I think you know Acid. Mm-hmm. Sunspore is more consistent. I don't want to have to worry about him waking up. Ooh, a switch. Huh. Let's check. Oh, oh nice miss, nice what miss. What the Oof. heck? All right, we're sending Gyarados now, which is our counter anyways, because uh, it's either going to have flying moves, which will intimidate, or water moves, which we take very easily, or supersonic, which okay. we're going to get supersonic. Do we try to supersonic whatever comes in chat? I think he's probably going at Gyarados, right? Goth comes back out. The switching is good. Nope. I read the switch, man. I never get rewarded. <laughs> We'll outspeed and then we'll switch if we get supersonic. Might as well. I don't think he switches here. He's just trying to get one kill on a Pokemon and he can't kill Goth. I think he knows he can't kill Goth. I mean, we have to seriously think about how the fuck we get a kill ever. I think it's just doomed, right? Yeah, some some sort of pursuit trap. Let's try to get a supersonic off. So much strategizing. He's thinking hard here. Easy flinch. Easy flinch. 
<clears throat> oh, easy miss. Hmm. Is he switching to Grovile now? I think he does. I think it's gonna be funny. What did you do? What did you do? Hmm. Ah, fuck. After I selected the move, I was like, okay, I should have probably hard rid a switch with wing attack, and it would have actually been rewarded too, because there's two things you can go to hmm. that actually work there. I mean, I figured even if you hit me, like your your attack was down once, right? Yeah. It's, like I, yeah, it's, yeah. So it should be fine. I mean, nothing you can do to me here. Even yeah, if it's a bit doomed, my friends. I'm not gonna lie. It's yeah, it's a tough, it's tough to to win this. Oh, you, wait, why didn't you use Pursuit for 4 when I was switching? Um, when you were switching on Marsh Tom, I was like, that Marsh Tom is asleep and it doesn't do anything against the other two Pokemon I have, oh. so you're never going to bring it out again, so the damage on it doesn't matter. Okay, that's really clever. I didn't think of it that way, because, yeah, you're just trying to kill something. Yeah, yeah this is a, a little bit slightly doomed. A little tough. I did confusion in case he switched. No I don't know. Yeah. It's doomed, unfortunately. This Groba has, like, no fucking damage output. Yeah, is the Absorb is the best move yeah. it has, right? For gra Like, come on, 20 yeah. power? Like, they think it would have taught a Mega Drain by now or something. Yeah. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I feel like I played this pretty well. There's really not much you could have done there, except that, like, the Supersonic hit might have helped. Yeah. But it's tough. This is yeah. hard. Like I said, I don't need to win the battle. I just need to win the war. I just need a couple of lucky hits. Yeah. This is so silly. I think I might get rid of uh, Mega Drain for Headbutt. I'm wild. Getting rid of Stab? What a freak. I'm just prepping for the gym. Don't mind me. Oh, Shroomish Evolution. I thought you'd be delaying that one. I am. You misheard it. That's actually my Oddish. It's time, Yawn. Prepare to die. I think I'll be fine, actually. You think you'll be fine? The way I think about it is not really any singular trainer in this game, right? You're every am, trainer. I'm every trainer. It's like in everything, everywhere, all at once. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. A goddamn little 17 Zigzagoon. Okay, so the way I take away one of his Pokemon here is to force out the Marsh Tomp by yawning it with Gulpin. You're unmuted. And the only way I do that... <laughs> well, I just revealed my entire strat. That's fine. <laughs> Let's do it anyway. Oh, no. I need you to um, miss... Yeah. Like two here. It's got to be bait. Was that bait or was that a genuine mistake? Did you start doing um, the mind games? I will not reveal. Is he playing me, Chad? He's never done that before. He's never messed up strategy ever. I can't remember which button it is. And if I press the wrong button, I have to fight battles. Yes. All right. Everything goes to 24. This is going to be really difficult for him. I don't know what comes out first, but we're just going to hope it's not anything serious. Let's just go for it. All right. I think this is my best chance so far to take something out. Really? It was either that or Brawly. I thought this would be the least chance. It's a hard fight. This is a hard fight? Can be. What do you know? You have four Pokemon. I guess if you get like really good luck, right? Okay, the question is, I think he's baiting me into self-destructing. I already picked my move if you're trying to mind game me. I think he's- Oh wait, shit, I'm not muted. Fuck. I muted my stream again. He, no. He's not, he's not a good liar. He is not a good liar. That one was- You could hear it in his voice. Okay, but unironically, I did hear him do a lot of clicks. I do think he's switching. But like, what would he switch to? So that knows- wait, Does it outspeed? I never considered that it might outspeed. That could be bad. You outspeed. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Doesn't kill the word. Mm, there's a lot though. Huh. He's playing for the crit. What else outspeeds? I don't know. The Manectric, does it have quick attack? Or does it have like bite? Magneton is faster than this. I can get a Sonic Boom in here before I die. He might miss Mudshot. Um, I think that's what the play that we go for. Or we go for the Super Sonic. Does he have another Voltorb? No, if he had another Voltorb, he would have just sent it out. Unless he's trying to save it to bait my... Oh, no. How much HP is he gonna be at? He's probably at like what 30 or something. I'm uh, probably more than that. Was Marsh I'm gonna have like 70 HP? Two Sonic Booms kill. So if he misses a Mudshot, he's actually in really big trouble. I needed those damn speed EVs. That's right. That's exactly right. Yeah. All right. Let's just try to do as much damage as we can and bring out the Magneton. If he misses, it's really good. But even if he doesn't, like I do so much damage that I force out a switch and then maybe I can get a kill with Manic Trick. Okay. What did you send out? What is it? This is the Pokemon I have to take out with Ad Sign. I have to. We have to. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Don't you dare miss. Don't you dare. Thank you. Okay. 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 
He's probably gonna howl now, isn't he? Does he just have to howl? There's actually a chance that this speed ties. I could leer with this. I don't think any of them have pursuit. Like, what they, they shouldn't have- they're electric types. They won't have pursuit. He dies in two quick attacks, and I think I live a mud shot. What if I just do it with electric? Electric dies to a mud shot for sure, right? Actually, no. There's a chance this survives. Hold on. It's taking a while to decide. He is really strategizing here. I think I can do quick attack twice with electric and force him out. There's a chance two quick attacks don't kill from electric, though. The fact that he's taking so long means they definitely don't have pursuit, so we don't have to worry about that. You think he switches out of Marsh Tom here if I go for it? Yeah, maybe I can threaten him enough to just switch. What did you decide? Should I do some psycho content shit where I just mud shot and predict the Thunder Wave? Because he knows I have to switch. I think I either Howl or I Thunder Wave. I think it's probably Thunder Wave. I could do it for the content. Just absolutely psych- Because he knows. He knows I have to switch. I have to switch. He either Howls or he Thunder Waves. The thing is, Howl guarantees that QA kills next turn. Fuck it. Fuck it. We're doing it. All for the content, baby. He knows I'm switching. But I'm a fucking idiot. He's either gonna howl or he's gonna thunder wave. I don't think I want to risk the T-wave. I think howl is a decent compromise. It's never quick attack. That's his only two options. He can't win otherwise. If he attacks, he just kills me. I've never been this nervous. He's taking so long. So he's at like 15, 16-ish maybe? He, he, he can't use quick... He can't. He literally can't use quick attack. Because if anything else comes out and he quick attacks, he just loses. I don't think he's switching. Well, he might. Quick attack is really bad if he switches. He, he has to howl. He has to thunder wave. He has to do one of the two. I'm howling. Oh my god! <laughs> yes! This doesn't kill, buddy. It doesn't? What? I thought that would kill. Oh, but your speed fell. Oh, but you have a berry. Do you outspeed now? I mean, now now we can't now we can't stay in. Now we just have to switch. He's 100% switching here, right? I think gone we have to send in here because he's probably going to quick attack. If he howls again, that's scary. I mean, I already, already made my decision. I think actually Thunder Wave, if he, I, he would probably go to Gloom, right? How much does plus one quick attack do to Gloom? <sighs> does he Thunder Wave? Oh, I bet I could I could I bet I could have mud shot again. I bet he Thunder Waves now. And Thunder Waving the Gloom kind of does nothing. There's no way he attacks this turn. I should have mud shot. There is no way he attacks this turn. I think Thunder Waving does nothing. Let's quick attack. Good luck. Good switch. Is it a good switch or should I stay it in? Oh, okay. <sighs> what the f that does so much damage. 75 accurate? Yeah, yeah, I think we I think we go there. I think we did that, we did that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good sleep powder at this point, right? Yep. I think if that hits me, it's GG. Yep. 75%. Is it 75? Wait, I thought it was 50% in this gen. Gen 3 is 75. I swear, I, I'm not lying, I'm just stupid. He's not smart. Uh, he thinks I'm messing with them, but I'm just an idiot. I think I just attack, right? He does like no damage back. I can stay in on this for a while. Hypnosis is 50%. That's what I was thinking of. Let's just QA, I think. Uh, I, ah! Come on. I One time. For uh, the boys. No! For the boys! No! Okay. What now? What do I do? He has to switch Breloom, right? M Manectric is like full HP. It's not going to kill. Do I need Gone? I might need to sack something here. Oh, God damn it. I was unmuted. He heard that entire I don't thing. Know how many levels of mind games where I'm just going to ignore everything you say from here on out? That was it. I was genuinely an accident. But he thinks it's a mind game. So we sleep powder. <sighs> if he quick attacks, Gone's dead. Gone's gone. I think he's double mind gaming me with what he said. I think he's probably staying in. I think quick attack is good. It already does good damage to Breloom. And then I can Thunder Wave and maybe get lucky when he switches to it. Bro, just make your decision. This is so intense. It's anything but quick attack. Thunder Wave me. Yeah, I also have potion. I think I think quick attack. I think Howl is like actually not that great here. He has potions too. Oh fuck. Dude, but if I run into the tra if if he if he's trapping me here and he's sleep powdering, I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to try to take the kill here in quick attack. Sick. Ah, uh, low roll. <sighs> We got one, baby! Yep, kill number one. You might get more than one, I'm gonna be honest. Okay, interesting. There's no way he switches because he's plus one. I'm not gonna switch because I want to keep my plus one. Okay, this is just fake out. It doesn't really matter what we do here. Maybe I get lucky and he gets a static proc. I think I'm fine here. I'll just take the I'll just take the quick attack. I don't really care. Or the fake out. Yeah, we just have to fake out. He's a one minus one, so I think I outspeed anyways. Okay. No matter what he did, we outspeed. Oh wait! I messed up. Quick attack and fake out of the same priority. I, wait, you didn't use it? Yeah. Oh, I thought I just outsped. 
Oh, I'm just I'm just stupid. I'm I'm Gen 4 pilled right now. Maybe I am mind gaming you, and you just got a quick clock off. Or you do outspeed. I'm trying to mind game you into that. I'm actually faster. Do I gain anything by switching out? We might need to sack a few things to take out this manectric. Yeah. Don't KO. Okay, please, just as long as you don't KO. Oh, another <laughs> crit, bro! No! Two hit, two hit, two hit. Two hit, two hit. No, five. Please, five hit, three crits in the middle. It's Come gonna on. Be two. It's going to be two. No, no, please, please. Yes, 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 there's three. Why is it doing so little damage? Okay, there's four. Yes. I got the five hit. Yeah. I got the five yeah. hit. I think this is a really decent time to heal because he's probably switching. I literally have to sack it now. I think him switching here is extremely correct. And like, even if he bullet seeds again, it's kind of fine. I have to sack or else he could get a free turn. He probably potions this turn. Free howl, then potion. I could get a free switch. Is he smart enough to switch? Because he potions, because he knows I can't do much damage. The thing is he can get more fake out value if he switches again in theory, right? Although I, I do know now about quick attack. There's no way he uses Thunder Wave, no way he uses Howl. He knows I have to attack. I think there's only one way we win this. All right, I'm healing here. R regardless of if he attacks or if he if he switches, heals really good here. Yeah, 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 max HP. I actually think Howl is pretty good here, getting another plus one, because it changes the damage calcs in my favor a lot here. What does he have? He has like Leech Seed? Please, 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 please. It's 90% accurate. Yeah, if he leech seeds, I'm kind of forced out. Because he wants to stay in because he's at plus one. Yeah, let's T-wave, and if he leech seeds, I can just switch. I think that's really good. Yes. Okay. Oh, Thunder Wave. Uh, we stun spore now. Oh, but now we don't outspeed with Mock Punch. That's probably what he was going for. This is always switch chat. I can't have him have leech seed up. And then I, I leer, I think. Oh, he switched. Oh, I did not expect that. But it's fine. As long... Nice. No. Damn it. Huge. That is terrible for me. Okay. Wait, that's fine. <laughs> no. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. We, we might lose because of paralysis bad luck. If we hit him with a stun spore, we would have easily won this. I think I just leer until I force this out, basically. Yeah. That's good. That's probably the best thing that could have happened, because I can just switch to get rid of it. Please. Yes. Finally, okay. I hit you with a move. What now? Does he attack? Because I need to get rid of the defense drops. I think I need, I'm i never switching out Electrike, basically, right? I think at this point, it's probably more efficient to just start quick attacking. He's still going to be faster than me because he has Mach Punch. I have to switch. No Thunder Wave. If he did Thunder Wave, he has a Giga Brain. Good, good. I think I just have to take the death here, right? Do we just go for a strong hit? Do I just go crazy with it? Well, that isn't that insane. Uproar is going to be his best move, right? No, I howl first. I howl first and then I uproar. I could go to Manic Trick, I guess. But am I really switching this Electric in again? How much does... Uh, uproar does like nothing to Manic Trick, really. I guess it doesn't matter. It takes four turns to kill this from here no matter what. Let's switch. I think switching into the Uproar is big. Let's see it. Oh, see what? What move you chose? Mm-hmm, what is it going to be? I should have supersonic shit. Interesting. Yeah. We're going to have to sack sub to alpha. I'm really glad I switched. We have plus one. We just need to hope we don't get one shot. If we don't get one shot, we're, we're feeling okay. No crit this time. No crit this time, okay? Woo! Oh my... Yes! All right, fair. Oh, I live this too. Let's go! Holy shit. I don't live this. I'm lying. Does he actually live this? The thing is, if I don't kill, I definitely kill him with Electric because he's locked in. I'm, I'm literally stuck in uproar. There's nothing that I can do. That crit was massive, bro. He's going to potion this turn. He has to potion this turn, right? I think I have to go for it. There's pretty much nothing better to potion on. I think I go for it. Let's see it. Come on. Oh, no. You kill me. 100%. You, even with a low roll, you kill me. Okay, yeah. <sighs> it looked like it. I think I think you might wipe me here. Okay, chat. Switch to Electric and heal. Yeah, we have to leech seed because he's gonna potion. He has another potion. Why did he use it? Maybe he's switching to potion. Good. Okay. Does he heal here? A Marsh Tom switch from him would be huge. If he quick attacks, does it kill Ad Sign? Yeah, that's actually insane because Electric doesn't kill it. The Marsh Tom switch here would be so big brain. Do you think he thinks of that? He gets a Leech Seed heal from it too. It's it's a frick. It's a little Electric because he'll hit me. I'll get Leech Seed back. I have to heal. I can't bring Mana Trick back in on Marsh Tom though. Oh, this is actually really tricky. I could Leer and then heal, predicting a Marsh Tom switch. That's okay. Okay, never mind. I might actually do damage. Wait, I have Poke Russ. <laughs> One of my Pokemon is Poke Russ. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's sick. What? <laughs> huh. 
It's a 1 in 20,000. He has to heal his Pokemon right now. There's no way he attacks, right? The thing is, I don't just want to win the battle. I, if I can take another kill, it's really big. If I could kill Marshtown, it'd be huge. I think Ad Sign is our only way to win. So mind gamey. I think Leer into heal is right. Yeah, I think the only way that I win this is if I get Leech Seed on Ad Sign, and then we're able to do one Mud Shot. God, that's terrifying. Heal is lose. Yeah, I think healing is really, really bad against Marsh Tomp. I think I gotta go for the Leer. I think if I if I heal now and he went Marsh Tomp, I kind of always lose. I, I I or I have no more chance of ever killing a Pokemon. But the only chance I have of killing a Pokemon again is if I Leer right now into the Marsh Tomp. All right, let's see it, Tanner. You didn't potion? Yes. Wait, what? Wait, why are we both saying yes? <sighs> Wait, why did we both say yes there? I actually didn't expect it to heal that much. I thought it would heal less. I, mean, I don't care if Quake Attack kills. We can just switch back. We just gained HP on that side. What the heck? Uh oh. You healed then. So this is always a Manic Trick switch, right? Does he switch back now? If he attacks, I just get HP back. I just broke it. Oh, fuck, he can just go to Breloom now and reset the situation. I don't really know what I can do. If he attacks me, then we Mock Punch. If he switches, then we Stun Spore. I think I have to go Manic Trick in case he goes Marsh Tomp, right? And then two quick attacks. No matter what he does, this is the right play. Okay, he didn't switch. Never mind, you did switch. Right, paralyzed. This, I'm so stressed out right now. This is terrifying. So this is either Leech Seed or Stun Spore from him. I have to Stun Spore. I'm still faster if he Stun Spores. We have to not get paralyzed. We have to hit Stun Spore and he needs to not, I don't know, whatever he does, we can't. I'm getting more coffee. Uh, I'm so scared, I don't wanna see it. I'm pretty sure Howl still gets me to kill a range of Marsh Tump. Oh my god! Oh! Okay, I'm trying to go- I think I, I want to go to plus two. Let's do it. And then I think I just need to get the better of the Parahex. Do I win now? Two mock Punches is probably- I, th I think two mock Punches KO. Let's do some- let's- let's do some damage. Now it's all a game of paralysis. <laughs> Who gets paralyzed? Yeah. Okay. Don't do a lot. That did nothing! Let's go! <sighs> yeah, barring paralysis, he wins this. We need to get crits. We need to get lucky. That did 15, so with a crit it does 30. So I can take three or two with a crit, which means I KO his Manectric as long as we don't get paralyzed. Could I have maybe just shockwaved before I howled? Is that maybe the plan? We just need to get lucky with paralysis. Okay, That's no the crit. condition here. Good. No paralyze. Good. All right, this is probably it. it. Could be. It depends on the paralysis. No crit, no crit, no crit, no crit, no crit. Good. Yes. GG. Oh. <sighs> This is the most stressful Pokemon battle I've ever had. Jeez. This is crazy. This is there's so much. Even with a crit, he doesn't KO. So it's safe to use Mock Punch. He's just Mock uh -oh. Punching, right? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Huge. Uh-oh. Yeah, no. no oh, don't worry okay. About it. Huge. Yeah, GG. Wow, that was fun. Holy shit. Oh, my God. Oh, so, I was so scared I wasn't going to make it through that. The Leer on the incoming Marshtomp was really interesting. I thought it would heal less from the Leech Seed, basically. Mm. And I thought that Leer, after two Leech Seed heals, is QA range from Manic Trick. It would have been Leer into heal Manic Trick into switch and then threaten the kill. Well, I made it out with two deaths. That's a... That was some really fun mind games. That was sick. That was a good battle. Oh, my God. I mean, you you did what you wanted to do. You almost got the win there. My God. Um, I feel I feel like that's a good good finale for the stream. We've been live for like for seven sure. hours. God, it's been seven hours. Yeah, we've been going for seven hours. It does not feel like that. <laughs> we should continue this when I come back. This is super fun. We should absolutely continue this. I agree. Oh my god. We beat gym three. <sighs>